Hey guys, what's going on? It's uh, St. Patty's Day, so you know what that means. It's time to make some corned beef. Uh, I'm going to do it sous vide. So what I have here is a regular old, I don't know, cheapo corned beef. Comes with a little spice packet in there, which makes this one of the easiest recipes around. So, first things first. What I'm going to do is just cut this thing open. Pull it out. Leave some of these liquids behind. Go ahead and take the spice packet out. Cut it open. And season. I normally boil this, but uh, and throw it in the water. But we're going to cook it to the Let's take a vacuum bag, which I've already curled the corners around so they don't get all mungy. And uh, just pop it in. Easy as that. Now you're going to want to get your water bath up to 175 degrees. I'm going to cook this for approximately 10 hours. We're going to seal this up. And uh, go on to the next step. It's that easy. So. There we go. Okay, our corned beef's ready. So, we're going to pop it into our 175 degree bath. And we're going to do that for about 10 hours. So, uh, make sure, since this thing really likes to float, keep it Lock, I'm locked down, uh, you know, however you can. With, I use a little uh, cookie rack that fits in this Cambro container perfectly. Uh, make sure that you cover this with a hood because there's going to be a lot of water evaporation. So I'm going to use some heavy duty foil, and uh, that's pretty much it. All right, our corned beef is done. Bear with me, this might take a moment or two. Uh, if you really want to get crazy, you can take the uh, juices from in here, which there are a lot of, and uh, you know, use it to cook some cabbage and other things like that in there. But it smells delicious. It looks incredibly tender. Uh, I'm just gonna let it sit here for a little bit. Take a look here. Do a little zoom in. Very nice looking piece of meat, even right out of the bag. Okay, we've cooled down a little bit. Now with this, it's especially important to cut against the grain, perpendicular to it. Cannot stress that enough. I'm pretty sure that's what we're doing here. Okay, as you can see, this is the outside piece, and uh, incredibly juicy. Very well done. I'm not even quite sure how it's going to taste, but we'll. We'll see here. Mmm. Mmm. That is just perfect. Absolutely perfect. It's a little bit crunchy, dry, you know, like when you boil it. But it just has so much more flavor than when you boil it. I don't know if it's just because of the spices that are in the bag. I don't know if it's because of all the the fat is completely rendered out. I mean, look at this. It looks like frickin' pate or something. It's just so unbelievably well cooked, but not dry. It's frickin' delicious. I'm gonna really have a hard time not eating this before it gets to my plate. So anyway, that's the corned beef. Thank you for watching. I really appreciate it. Got any questions, just leave a comment. And uh, if you're interested in my setup, also hit the show more button and uh, pretty much pick up everything in the video there. Again, thank you very much. Okay, there you go. There's dinner. Fantastic St. Patrick's Day dinner. Thank you very much for watching. If you have any questions or comments, well, leave a comment. <laughs>